Coach, down the stretch of the game in the Atlanta ending as well, you had a really big lineup out there. I think JV was basically your two man. Can you tell me a little bit about why you went to that larger lineup? Is that something we should expect this season? Um, I think with us, we're very versatile, so we like we like we feel comfortable really with that lineup. And the way things worked out, we felt like those guys are really going to give us the best chance to win the end. That's why we went with that lineup. Chris, talk about um, obviously the first game for the franchise. Um, what were the feelings of the players inside the locker room? Um, I know you wanted to get this W in the first one. Cole hit his first hoop. Of course. The whole atmosphere it was incredible in here. Of course. Yeah, I mean, it was a very exciting time for everybody, the league, Scarborough, all the players. We were all excited. You know, great atmosphere in golf here. And, you know, we want, we, we want to play, we want to win. And, you know, it's, it's a long season. We'll continue to get better and we'll go from here. How do, you, how do you track fans? But like show them this game, right? That's got to get people. So you guys play like this? Yeah, I, th I think um, our, st our style of play, even the league style of play, and obviously the Elam ending is, is great and it's exciting. So um, I think for both franchises, um, today, was a, today was a great day for both and great for the league and bringing that excitement and I, th and I you know, hope to see this team down the road. Do you think a guy like Jermaine will bring people in and then they'll, they'll come back because they see the game? I think you know so. What I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Legacy. Yeah, I, th I think so. I think, um, you know, t today, you know, Cole did a great job, and, and you know, he played his heart out. And I think, you know, what he brings is also excitement, and he, br and he brings, you know, a certain fan base that uh, we want to continue to see the game. Right. I think all those things are great things for everybody. Great, thanks, Chris. I appreciate that very much. No problem. We'll go two more questions. Coach, just, uh, what was it like to just, you had a, only really a week of training camp. What was it like to just see the guys come together like that so quickly? We had a week, but everybody had a week too, right? So we're all kind of in the same boat and in terms of preparing and trying to do the best um, we can. So I think um, my challenges were no different than any other coaches in the league. All the young Canadians uh, out here, and you see Nikhil and O'Shea, and, and, and it's just uh, to see where Canadian basketball has gone, uh, and it continues to go. Um, talk about you, what you see out here, man, especially tonight, atmosphere. And I, I can only imagine in Scarborough uh, next Saturday. Right. Like, I, I think, you know, if we're talking about atmosphere, we're talking about the level of play. If you look at where the league started and where it is now, um, the competition continues to get better and better. Every day there was some great games last night as well as a great game today. So I think the game is just going to continue to grow. The league's going to get better and start bringing more and more better players. And, you know, and, and Canada, Canadian players are continuing to be great also, right? So um, that's a testament to all the development um, throughout the country, and we'll continue to see that grow.